welcome to the voice of the Lord. Our verse for today is in Proverbs 24 verse 10. If you falter in times of trouble, how small is your strength? Yes, if you falter, if you shake in times of trouble, how small is your strength? Friends, many of us, we can be as bold as a lion we can be as strong as we want to project in times when there are no troubles. You know, in good times, we can project, wow, I'm strong, I have faith. You know, the words that we use, friends, it can shake even mountains, you know, the boldness that we have. But how about in times of trials? When we are now actually being tested, can we still stand our ground? Or will we falter? Or will we shake? Friends, today we are being reminded not to falter in the days of trials. Like in this particular case that we're in today, COVID. Friends, how are you dealing with this? Are you shaking as if you have no faith? As if you have no God? Yes, do everything that you can to shield yourself. But do you have peace in your heart though? Do you have fear in your heart? Do you believe that God is still able to heal if ever you are afflicted with this COVID? Friends, we are told that if we falter in the days of trouble, how small is our strength? How small is our faith? But friends, if we can only have faith in God, then we can overcome this all. How many people do you think would suffer when, you know, when they know that they are afflicted and suddenly their, uh, their immune system will go down and then they could feel all kinds of pain. They could all feel all kinds of, uh, of symptoms just because they came to know that they have been afflicted. But prior to that, friends, they didn't care. They didn't care because to them, there was no test. They were able to overcome it all. But suddenly the test came and they faltered. So friends, I pray that we grow in that faith in the Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. Let us be strong. Let's do everything that we can pass, uh, physically uh, to, to avoid all kinds of trials and problems. The way that uh, we can actually handle. But beyond that, friends, put everything in the hands of God. And trust in His unfailing love. Because we cannot do it anyway. Amen? He is our shield, our protector. He will help us in times of trials and problems. And definitely, friends, He will not abandon us. And so, let this be the encouragement that you have, friends at this time when we are being tested let's trust in the lord he is still seated at the right hand of god ever praying ever pleading ever interceding for our case amen and so friends trust in the lord jesus christ all will go well as we put our faith in him May the Lord bless you. May the Lord keep you. May His face shine upon you and be gracious unto you and lift up His countenance on you and give you His peace, His love. God bless. See you again next time.